So Chelsea, a little bit nerve-wracking there. How were your nerves going into that last 20 minutes? Yeah, the last 20 minutes were definitely intense and um, it was one of those things where I was feeling really confident in the group the whole entire game. And despite the intensity and, and obviously the back and forth that was happening, um, I was actually at some sort of a, a calm piece with it because we were playing very, very well and uh, they were doing all the right things. And at the end of the day, it's, uh, it was just getting the right balance against a good, uh, strong opponent and, and I'm happy with how the result turned out. Only the second clean sheet of the season and what a time to get it as well. And let's talk a little bit about that winning goal. The, the play from Nicky Vert to set it up, Maddie on the edge of the box to, to keep hold of the ball and then dancing through. We've seen that from these players this year, but I mean, it was just a special goal to, to send you into the playoffs. It really was a special goal for a lot of reasons. I would say uh, from the internal side of it, we're, we're a group that is fantastic in possession and on the ball. We do really, really great things. Um, but something that we've been really working on and, and trying to push and, and, and get out of our players is the bravery to take risks and uh, challenge themselves in the attacking third in the sense of, of they have so much potential to, to do those great things. And today was it was an awesome goal, yeah, because we got the goal and the result and it got us to playoffs, but uh, they're doing great things that we haven't seen before. So it was, it was excellent all around. But when you look at the squad, I mean, it's so heavily depleted. Some of your key performers for the, the season haven't been here. To go out and put in a display like that, a couple of grade 12 girls coming on and the tackle from one of them, Katie Chan at the end, which, what a mistime that and that's a penalty. I mean, that says a lot about this group. Giving them the freedom to, to be, be brave and trust themselves and go out there, that's step one. Uh, but honestly, you know, that's such a, a wonderful thing about this program is we are bringing young players in. And the fact that they feel empowered and confident going in, despite having players of pedigree surrounded by them, um, it just says a lot about not, not only what environment TSS has created, but the players, the Joannas. Uh, we've got the Delanas, we've got even Nikki Burke, like the senior players in there that are just really picking these players up and, and guiding them through and it's, it's showcasing really nicely. So into the playoffs now, you know it's the Whitecaps you're facing there in some form at the moment, but you gave them a close game just a few weeks ago. What are you expecting from that next weekend? I'm expecting a really good show and, and anyone that's a football fan in Vancouver, I really hope that uh, we see a lot of people out there because you've got talented athletes on both ends. Uh, and both games have been really entertaining. So it's going to be exciting for, for the fans and everyone out there, but it's also going to be uh, exciting for, for this group who's definitely earned it. Well, congratulations, and we'll see you next weekend. Well done, Chelsea. Fantastic. Thank you so much.